Today let me show you how you could use the compact map operator. The compact map operator in Swift Combine is an operator that is similar to the Swift standard library's compact map, wherein it helps you eliminate the nil values and then return a non-nil value for you. In this example, I am going to use the dictionary where we would be printing out the values using the numbers uh, key here. So the sequence of numbers will be from 0 to 5. Let me start with printing all the values in the dictionary. I'm going to use the publisher from this number sequence. Normally, if you're working with a sequence, it, a publisher is available wherein you could use it for creating subscriptions. So I'm going to create a subscription using the sync method. And then this sync method will return uh, the integer from this sequence of numbers. I'm going to name this as number key. And what I would like to do next is access each of these values using this number key. So I'm going to print the value using the print method and then use the dictionary and then pass the number key as the key and whenever we are creating subscriptions it always return on any cancelable object so I need to store that object in my cancelable variable and let us see what we have okay so it now printed all the values from the dictionary plus some nil values and then the values are not uh, are wrapped at the moment but I don't want it like this I want to be able to access the values right away to help me with that I'm going to use the compact map operator let me start with moving the sync subscription and then I'm going to add the compact map method Just like before, it will return each value from this range of values from 0 to 5. And I'm going to call this number key, just like before. And then I'm going to copy the example below and return this. And here, we need to return the, or we need to set the type of value that we're returning which is a string. Since in our dictionary, we have an integer as a key and the value as string. And I just need to modify this name as value. And we're going to print that. And what we did is we just added the compact map wherein it will access the value from all the values in this dictionary and where, whenever it encounters a nil value then it will skip that and then whenever it encounters a non-nil value then it will unwrap it for us so by the time it gets to the subscriber it will just print the non-nil value so i'm going to rerun this Now, since we have used the compact map operator, we don't see the nil values anymore. And the compact, compact map operator also unwrap the values for us. So if ever you're going to work with optionals and a series of values, then you might want to consider using the compact map operator.